Welcome everyone to another extreme off road silly build and today we're dealing with a 1986 Lamborghini LM002. It has a 710 horsepower 5.6 litre V12 and it weighs 4486 pounds. Now this was originally made for the military, for the Italian military, uh, but then just got put into a production for uh, civilians. It has a the V12 from a Countach, though it's obviously been upgraded now. And yeah, high ground clearance, big tyres, all wheel drive from standard. So yeah, this should uh, be rather impressive. So let's see what it can do. It should easily deal with all the bumps and jumps, because like I said, High ground clearance, big tyres, made for off-roading. So hopefully it won't disappoint. I mean, yes, it is in the lower class, it's not the highest class of S2, but it probably won't be the fastest or even close to being the fastest. It certainly shouldn't be the slowest. But obviously, it does weigh a fair bit, and it doesn't have all the horsepower in the world. So seven. 10 horsepower is near the highest amount that we've had on here. Hopefully that will mean it's more controllable. As you can see it's doing fairly well already. This jump will be the ultimate test. Perfect to find that. The only reason I went slightly off is because of me. Pass for it. Something that weighs f nearly 4,500 pounds. It certainly handles rather well around this course. stock suspension it's dealing with the jumps especially in terms of landing really well it's not going down by the nose which you'd expect for a car that has a 12 on the front as you can say it's rather tame The walls doesn't help, does it? It's the only major problem we had. That jump then. Fairly quick time. It's easily the fastest car we've had that weighs as much as that. Uh, which is no surprise considering it's far and away the more suitable SUV that we've had on this course. As you can see, big high ground, ground clearance and those big chunky tyres all around. So it was made for that kind of thing. So yeah, no surprises really. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.